But we know how things are gonna go. Whoa! Already? What up, David here with Rumpa 3, The End of Hope's Peak Academy. This is Despair Arc Episode 3 now. Last time we had a weird one that uh, escalated quickly. Uh, we, we got very gamey and very steamy and very all sorts of fun, all sorts of antics. And I, I do see that dark cloud manifesting its ugly head maybe in this episode. So let's see what's going on with Hajime and the gang and the, the whole gang and Chisa, of course. And then also we got, uh, I forgot her name, uh, but Fuyuhiko's sister. She's going to be here too now. So can't wait to see what goes on. Let's jump in. All right. Mr. Hajiman, alone. Welcome to Hope's Peak Academy. A one-of-a-kind campus for one-of-a-kind talents. Hmm. It's a preparatory school without equal in all of Japan. All right. What would that feel like? It looks so mad, Over sad. Some special skill. And walk through the gate into the academy's main school because I belong there. I don't excel at anything. Oh. No sports. No music. No cooking. Oh, that's a good shot. I'm just average. Hmm. Okay, I don't know what to talk about right now during this intro. I love this song though. There's something I really like about this song, this intro song. Make sure to look it up when you can. I, I deliberately cut it from these episodes. Okay, so now. We got Fuyuhiko's sisters joining Hajime's class, which is very interesting. I never imagined those two together. Mahiru's gonna kill her eventually, so I, uh, that'll be interesting. Mikan's gonna be somewhat involved, Hiyoko's gonna be somewhat involved, of course Fuyuhiko's gonna be somewhat involved, because Fuyuhiko is guy F. Um, <laughs> God, the memories. Ugh, Junko? When is Junko gonna show up? Unless she already has. I do think she and Chisa look very, very similar. I just don't think it works out that Chisa is Junko or whatever. But at this point, who knows? But for now, Izuru's on the horizon, and I'm just looking for that seed of when these guys go, go dark. Oh yeah, and let's learn about the reserve course. All these blue people. <laughs> is that a Kadra baguette? Shame and normalcy. Either way, I gotta decide. Hey. Hey, dumbass! Hmm? Uh -huh. It's so weird the way you stare at the main course building. Hmm. Why do you care what I do? Bet you don't have any friends here. It's a song. Because we're alike in that regard. Honestly, your people skills could use some work. I don't know why they tossed me into this classroom with the rest of you dead end trash fires. Been nice to meet you. I like her. And I meant every word of it. <laughs> I'm a super high school level little sister, and this place is Loserville, the Kuza Ryugumi. Wait, you mean like the Yakuza? Uh huh. My dad's the one who's calling all the shots. But someday it's gonna fall to my big brother, the super high school level gangster himself. That's a talent? And since Big Bro is such a talented guy, that means I've got to be a super high school level little sister. Go on, you can tell me how right I am now. But you're here in the reserve course like us. You'd be over with the others if you were elite. Just because they haven't let me in doesn't mean they're never gonna. Huh. Some of us haven't given up on the future yet. <laughs> what the hell? Useless you meatheads, every one of them. Again. I'm getting into that main course, and I don't care who I gotta step on. <laughs> What if one of those guys dropped out of the program? Then there'd be an open slot, huh? There's a certain freckle-faced bitch who comes to mind right away. <laughs> <laughs> Natsumi, I'm on to you. Hey, Satom, long time no see. Small world, huh? You weren't eavesdropping on me, were you? Save the smile for someone who buys it. You're up to something, I can see it in your eyes. <laughs> wow, paranoid much, Sato? <laughs> <laughs> I love her confidence. You two know each other more or less she was in the photography club at my last school's all i don't care who your family huh. is if you hurt her i am gonna make you pay <laughs> ah don't you get in my face and threaten me or end some basic thing. interesting leave my alone and we don't have a problem 
Oh. I'm sorry. I need to get back there. The I want. Also, what are you going to do? Sick one of your Yakuza flunkies on me? Sato, don't do this. Freckle face. That's totally... My huh. Room, we were just talking about you. I can't imagine why an elite from the main course would come down here. Is it self-defense? I Sato that we would... Wait, let me guess. You wanted to go slumming it so you could mock these talentless meat sacks. Ha. Huh. <laughs> oh, she bad. Hey, come on. Jeez, I'm pulling your leg. Yeah, well, you better be. Your brother's in the same class as Mahiru. That ain't gonna save you. Snitches get stitches. Or they end up with toe tags. Catch my drift. <laughs> you haven't changed at all. Oh, get off your high horse, you simpering dish rag. You're the same goody-goody little twit you were back in photography club. How stupid are you? The main course didn't offer you a spot because you're not special. Get that through your head already. Stop acting like such a bitch. You're no better than anyone else. No, what are you calling it? We don't fight. Just we, drop it. We don't fight. <laughs> Come on. You shouldn't have been talking to her like that. I know, but it felt really good to take her down a peg. She's gonna die. For aside, <laughs> the pictures I take are just of whatever. It doesn't matter. The world's gonna see all the beauty you bring into it. <laughs> so, uh... I hope you like what I whipped up for our lunches today. Oh, cute. Hamburger steak for two. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Oh, she's gonna push her off a building, <laughs> isn't she? You haven't even tried it yet, silly. Dude, how'd you summon these rabbits? I think I'm gonna understand why like Mahiru... In the yeah. reserve course? Yeah. She wanted to be at the same school as me, so the old man cut a check. My sister's been crazy since the day they brought her home. No telling what she might try to pull. I don't have a type, okay? Shall I bring you some answers? <laughs> <laughs> Stop being a dumbass. How many times do I gotta say it? Jeez. The gang retired you, Pekoyama. But, but oh. still. I brought it up so I could tell you not to do anything crazy and half cocks like every other damn time. Oh, what? Well, ain't this a rare sight? I've never seen you two talking before, and here you are doing it all secret like. <laughs> Go ahead, you guys. Just act like I'm not even here. Oh, I'm my God. Here. You two have fun. <laughs> Oh, uh, Miyota. Ibuki. Hey, games. Your focus was all over the place. That's why you lost. Did something happen today? Hey, Nanami. What's eating you, Hajime? You, like, sucked at video games. Would you still bother to play him? I want to know how bad I would be. Like, if you always lost no matter how much you played one. Or the puzzles never made any sense. Hmm. I wonder if they'd still be fun for you if that were the case. Hmm. Even if I were horrible, I think I'd love them. That's how great they are. But what if somebody else were the super high school level gamer? And every time they left your score in the dust. There's more to life than just talent. Huh? Miss Yuki Zomi likes to tell us stuff like that all the time. <laughs> she says talent is never a guarantee of an interesting life. True. Making memories with other people leads to hope. The time we spend together playing all these games... I like it. Well, I know a lot of talented people. Yeah, it's it's yeah. what you do and what kind of person yeah. you are. So this I get this. Fun. In that case, let's keep going. You're finally ready for the world of co-op. Yes, ma'am. Maybe things are starting to look up. Oh, what's gonna... Oh, I know exactly what's gonna make him mad. So, or, uh, you know. Whatever you're gonna spring on Mahiru, forget about it. Huh? Jeez, not this crap again. How delusional are you? All the scheming in the world isn't going to change anything, so just give it up. It doesn't matter that your dad's a big shot. He can't just buy you a talent. But even if he could, Mahiru would always be better than you. Get bent. You're just a lovesick hack who trails after her all the time. Like toilet paper on a shoe. You bitch! Sato, no! <laughs> you just signed your death warrant. Oh, God. Wait, I believe it. Wait, hold on! I always knew she was evil. Mahiru. I swear I'll protect you from that demon on my life. Oh, God. I promise, no matter what. <sighs> oh, Natsumi, not Hatsumi. That's what I now, thought it was last time. I know you and Sato don't get along, but still, you can't threaten people like that. What do you care? You're just some rando from the reserve course. I can do whatever I damn well please. So are you. Once they catch wind of this, they'll probably kick you out. Shut up already! You don't know a thing. I'm getting that transfer no matter what. I've got talent. I know I do. 
Conversation between these two, man. Why does this matter to you? Why is the main course so important? My brother's the super high school level gangster. If I'm not a super high school level little sister, I'm left behind. There's more to life than just talent. I get it. Feeling like you're left behind must be the worst thing ever. <laughs> but I... I don't think you have to be a top student or an elite. What does that even mean? In this world, you either make the cut or you don't. The end. You love your big brother, don't you? Talent isn't even a factor. Just stay with him and make memories together. My brother deserves the very best, and that includes all of the people around him! Huh. I want him to be proud of me. I'm not looking down from above. I want to stand by his side. And as soon as I'm a super high school level little sister, I can be with him again, no problem. Hmm. I mean, yeah, I like her, okay? <laughs> I do. They deserve the very best, huh. including the people around them. Well, we know how things are gonna go. Whoa! Already? Why are the police here? Some kid got murdered, I think. Huh? Oh yeah, we got a straight up homicide here. Whoa! This that was fast. Kid, supposedly, not Sami or something like that. Ah! Oh. Damn! This this happened this happened fast. Oh, does my hero? Oh shit! Oh shit! Uh. Does my hero take the blame the Tell rap for this? Truth, Please, what happened yesterday? No. You couldn't have. She, it had to have I been wanted, her. I wanted to watch the life leave her eyes. <laughs> Great. How could I just sit and wait for her to spring her trap on you? Look, if she hadn't died, she would have killed you. You remember this scar, right? Remember in middle school when the two of you got into an argument and I jumped in to stop it? Later that same night, someone did this. I'm sorry. I didn't no, know. There's nothing to apologize for. Really? I don't blame you for asking me. You didn't kill her then. Honestly, I couldn't hurt a fly. I said those things to scare her off. You do believe me, don't you? Hmm. Yeah. Wait. I believe you. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this this might be even okay. wilder I should than, probably I, be going. than I thought. Hmm. See ya. This is gonna be even wilder than I thought. Yeah, so no, I think the events are as they were. Sato. What exactly were the two of you talking about? She's dead, and people saw her threaten you. Look, I didn't murder her. Is that what you want me to say? So where'd you go after she stormed off yesterday, huh? She was Yakuza. Of course she was gonna die young. Or maybe she offed herself. Ever think of that? Maybe she couldn't face another day of being a talentless harpy and gave up. Who's she? I don't like Suicide. her. Suicide. Had to have been. Natsumi hadn't given up on anything! Huh. Talented or not, she still had hope for the future. Hope that- You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong! No! Wait, did Mahiro do it? Did Mahiro do it and she takes the blame for it? Oh! Oh! This is gonna be wild. This is gonna be wild. Alright, let's dedicate our efforts to Kuzu Ryu, who was taken from us far too soon. Yeah, Excuse I know. Me, but where's Sato? Sato never did show up. Not that day, or the next, hmm. or the one after that. Then, on the fourth day, they finally found Sato's body. Oh, the right, there were two of them. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Gotta fly. Freeze, kid. That's a reserve course uniform. The hell do you think you're going? I need to ask Mahiru Koizumi in the main course a question. I'll be quick about it. No way! But... No buts about it. You know the rules. Hey! Ugh. Look, I need to get in there! I... Campus police the worst. Rules don't apply to you, is that it? I know you. Then you know I'm in charge of security for all of Hope's Peak. Ugh. I'll let it go just this once. Now get the hell out of here. 
Oh, you were on his shit list for a while. Hold on! I want to know the truth, not the version they're feeding us in class. Hold on to your ass. Yeah. Is he gonna kick him? Kuzu Ryu was killed by an unknown intruder on school grounds. Oh wait, that's not Makoto. It's Tadi. Sato died from the shock of losing a classmate. Wish I had more to tell you, but I wait, 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 hold on. What? I, I missed a thing. I missed a thing. I'm just trying to. I, I realize he he hasn't been on his shit list. No, that's Hajime. It's not Makoto. I don't know why I got him mixed up. You want the truth, do you? Okay, let's in that hear this. Case, hold on to your ass. Miss Kuza Ryu was killed by an unknown intruder on school grounds. Right. And Miss Sato died from the shock of losing a classmate. Wish I had more to tell you, but I don't. Don't what? lie to me! No. Desks will be filled before their bodies have gotten cold. What did you just say? You bastard! Aren't you a boxer? <laughs> he is. <laughs> Only skill you kids bring to the table is getting daddy to cut a big check. Useless in life and a hassle in death. You bring down the whole place either way. Pitiful. <coughs> so what if they weren't one of your precious elite students? Our lives are all worth the same. <coughs> no, they're really not. You can't make diamonds out of empty beer bottles. Why don't you run along and play? Go crawling back to your dead-end buddies. Go delude yourselves into thinking you're someone. Go on. I can read you like a book. Hung out with an elite and now you're all uppity. Uh. Get a little attention from your betters and you cling on to them like a leech. There's more to life than just being talented. I think you're on to something. You're so right. For a drone such as yourself, there's all sorts of things you can focus on. Like toiling for the sake of your masters. Turn off your brain and fit into your slot. Anything more is futile. Why is everyone worse you than Biakia all of a sudden? Take to the collar and leash already. We'll be sure to throw you the occasional bone. <laughs> I'm gonna send you to the hospital, you bald yeah. little punk! True. Chaser! Chaser! Knock it off. Yukizome. You're bleeding. <laughs> Oh, her little mono monogram thing. Hope you haven't forgotten what we came back here to do. Hmm. Munakata's orders were very clear. Investigate the dark side of Hope's Peak. I've been investigating. Don't forget who you're talking to. Also, don't think I'm going to let you beat up a student. That's inexcusable, mission or not. I think Munakata hit the nail on the head, though, when he said the Academy has a sickness. Oh, come on, it's the end of the episode. Oh, it must be my internet today. Okay, well, while it loads, I do want to say some things. First of all, he sucks. I, okay, Sakakura, he, he just treating Makoto, treating Hajime the same way. I mean, I thought I got him mixed up earlier, so who am I? But, oh, God, he's he's worse than Byakuya. And Byakuya pissed me off in the first, the first uh, bits of Danganronpa. Yeah, uh, but like he's a good character. He's annoying as hell, but like I like his character because it's the whole clash of ideals thing. And you know what? You have characters that are like, yeah, you know, talent isn't everything, and then there are others that are like, no, there actually is a difference between us. So it's it's really cool how they're making something that is so simple, super gray, by having a series of black and white characters. It's it, it's funky. It's funky as hell. In the head though. When he said the Academy has a sickness. They're trying to sweep the whole Kuzuryu incident under the rug. And yeah. It's working. The other teachers have gone into damage control mode too. I've been told to downplay it to the kids when it comes up. Instead of stepping up in a crisis, they're just covering their asses. Why were you so brutal with Hinata if you agree with him? If he comes anywhere close to the truth, he'll be the one on a slab in the morgue. I can't argue with that logic, but you huh. can probably save his life without threatening to maim him. Yeah, yeah, I'll play nice. You know, it's hard to believe how bad things have actually gotten around Hope's Peak. Sorry, gotta hear that again. Come. I see, so he does agree with Hajime, he's protecting him? Ah, man, what's going on here? And Munokata is the school's one hope. You're right, it's fate is in his hands. Huh? Huh. Huh. If you think you can steal him away, you, Mr. Boxer, have another thing coming. 
Just because I think he's the school's salvation doesn't mean I'm gunning for a piece. I should be getting back. You were like a real teacher defending that boy the way you did. Hmm. I picked up a new game for us to play. I love that gold color. <laughs> I can't. It's just I have to go somewhere today. Sorry, it's really important and I can't miss it. Oh. So, okay. Hajime was being pulled in both directions. And Sakakura's lie actually might have pushed him over the edge. Oh! Nata, wait! Yeah? What's up? I... Nothing. What are you gonna say? You're not gonna say anything. You're anime. Romance can't happen this early. It was nothing. Nanami. Huh? Are you making memories at Hope's Peak? I want you to make a bunch of them for me. There's way more to you than just a super high school level gamer. Your character stats are off the charts. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> See you later. Yeah. Oh, he's going through with it. See you tomorrow. When I saw you, I wanted to be able to say, Hey, I have a talent. Look at this crazy thing I can do. I'm empty though. Ugh. I can't do anything. But you can take something empty and fill it. Is he doing it tomorrow? Is he doing it tonight? <laughs> the subject has decided to undergo the procedure. Oh. I'm not a fan. Ain't nothing good gonna come of cooking up artificial talent. Finally, you've come to a decision, boy. Yes. I've made my choice. You make him sound any less evil? I'll be their hope. Ugh. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna carve his brain like a Christmas ham. All right, let's let's uh, man, Urgh. wild. Also, was there credits to that episode? That was a lot, and yeah, that whole uh, I forgot the name of the game in Dongamarumpa Two, but so I forget what actually happened because I know it's illustrated in the game. I believe Mahiru kills. What's her face? She kills Kuzuryu. Uh, Fuhiko's like, I'm gonna kill that whatever, but he forgets because stuff. And then, uh, does Mahiru also kill? Or at least, do they, does she frame the other girl, Sato? Oh, I gotta go back to like all that because now I gotta see it again. <laughs> but yeah, that was great. Um... Uh, what, what was her face again? Uh, okay, Natsumi Kuzuryu. Let's... I, I've never liked a character over the course of as little screen time she had. She's a little firecracker. And she's cool, honestly. Like, she's messed up in the head a little bit, but I, I kind of liked her. I, I kind of dug her. She was funky. I don't have a type. Um, so... Anyway, Natsumi. But it's okay, I got Chisa until episode one of future arc but uh i'm i'm really looking forward to where this goes how's junko gonna manifest again like i i think chisa gives me mad junko vibes i just don't think it works out that she's her i just don't think it works i don't think it it lines up you know uh because junko's supposed to be hella dead and chisa's still alive in future one so i don't know what's going on there but as far as I can see, Jinka's just going to pop out of nowhere, undermine Chisa, maybe make her into Usami. Ch uh, Chiaki might be collateral damage and also gets plugged into the Matrix. And uh, we'll see. That's a whole other ball of wax. I can't wait, though. This is becoming my favorite one. I, I really like the despair arc. It's, it's just sad. It's like... You know how everything's gonna go, and so it's just like, ah, I see now. So, I'm gonna end it off here. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to like this video if you like this video. Subscribe if you haven't. Smack the bell so you never miss a thing. Consider supporting me on Patreon. Thank you, Bladed Cross and Fill in the Blanks for supporting me on Patreon. And we are gonna head into Future Arc Episode 4 next time. For now, this is Dave out. Peace out. Later!